Hello, wonderful people of God. So we come your way this month with exciting news from the camp of our man of God, Dr. Abel Damina, as he shares insights with us on the knowledge of the scriptures concerning the character of God in salvation. So we want you to stay glued to your screen as you let's for a few minutes critically look at that word the law the law because we're holistically examining this subject now the question to always ask when the word law is seen is what was being explained or what was being referred to by the writer what was being explained or what was being referred to by the writer that means therefore that the word law should not be given an omnibus application it should not be given an omnibus application rather the context of usage ought to be noted to determine the meaning of the word law there's no general use of the word law it is context that will determine what the author means by the word law now let's examine the word law in the four gospels read for me john chapter 7 verse 40 john 7 40 <clears throat> many of the people therefore when they heard this saying said of a truth this is the prophet next verse others said this is the christ but some said shall christ come out of galilee next verse hath not the scripture said that christ cometh of the seed of david and out of the town of bethlehem where david was next verse so there was a division among the people because of him next verse and some of them would have taken him but no man laid hands on him next verse then came the officers to the chief priests and pharisees and they said unto them why have ye not brought him next verse the officers answered never man speak like this man next verse then answered them the pharisees are ye also deceived next verse have any of the rulers or of the pharisees believed on him next verse but these people who knoweth not the law are cursed these people who knoweth not the law are cursed next verse nicodemus saith unto them he that came to jesus by night being one of them 51 Doth our Lord judge any man before it hear him and know what he doeth? Doth our Lord judge any man before it hear him? The word law was applied to describe the scriptures in this context. The word law in this context is used to describe the scriptures. Look at John 10, 33 to 34. John chapter 10 verse 33 to 34 the jews answered him saying for a good work we stone thee not but for blasphemy and because that thou being a man makest thyself god next verse jesus answered them is it not written in your law i said ye are god is it not written in your law so it was applied for doctrine or teaching the word law in this context was applied for doctrine or teaching and it can also be prophecy the word law can be used as prophecy or it can be used generally as the word of god the word law in other words the entire old testament was called the law the entire old testament was called the law Look at John 15, 23. John chapter 15, verse 23. Are you still in the building? John 15, 23. He that hateth me hateth my father also. Next verse. If I had not done among them the works which none other man did, they had not, they had, not had sin. But now have they both seen and hated both me and my father. Next verse. But this cometh to pass that the word might be fulfilled that is written in their law they hated me without a cause that the word might be fulfilled that is written in their law in the scriptures 
They hated me without a cause. The psalm says, avenge those who avenge me. And the book of Psalm is referred to as the law. And that is in Psalm 35 verse 1. Avenge those who avenge me. Look at John 18.47. PJ, John 18.47. Jesus therefore, knowing all things that should come upon him, went forth and said unto them, Whom seek ye? Whom seek ye? He was quoting from Deuteronomy chapter 17 verse 6. Jesus was quoting from Deuteronomy 17 verse 6. Now let's look at Paul's usage of the word law. Romans 3 19. Romans chapter 3 verse 19. Now we know that what things soever the law saith, it saith to them who are under the law. That every mouth may be stopped and all the world may become guilty before God. Now, those verses or the verses quoted from verse 10 of Romans 3 will be found in the book of Psalms. Whatever Paul was quoting in that Romans 3 from verse 10 up, you will find it in the book of Psalm 14 verse 1 to 3. Psalms 14 verse 1 to 3. And then in Romans chapter 3, verse 9 to 15. PJ, read for me. Romans 3, verse 9 to 15. What then? Are we better than they? No, in no wise. For we have before both, but we have before proved both Jews and Gentiles that they are all under sin. Next verse. As it is written, there is none righteous, no, not one. Next verse. There is none that understandeth, there is none that seeketh after God. Next verse. They are all gone out of the way, they are together become unprofitable. There is none that doeth good, no, not one. Next verse. Their throat is an open sepulchre, with their tongues they have used deceit. The poison of asps is under their lips. Next verse. Whose mouth is full of cursing and bitterness. Next verse. Their feet are swift to shed blood. Their feet are swift. To shed blood. So, what will be the law? Romans 3, where we are, verse 20 to 21. 20 to 21. Read for me. Therefore, by the deeds of the law, there shall no flesh be justified in his sight. For by the law is the knowledge of sin. Next verse. But now the righteousness of God without the law is manifested, being witnessed by the law and the prophets. Now, in the scriptures where we just read, the law was referenced for number one, the first five books, Genesis to Deuteronomy, is referred to as the law. Genesis to Deuteronomy. Number two, the Psalms of David are referred to as the law. Then number three, the Old Testament generally is referred to as the law. Then number four, the law in reference to sin, the knowledge of sin is referred to as the law. So which means there should be no biased understanding or application of the word law. It is context that defines which law we are talking about. We are so grateful for having you here on our platform. Kindly head the subscribe button if you are new here and also like this message for us do well to comment in the comment section because we want to know what you learned and where you're watching us from thank you message community